telling the story is something that you've emphasized in your work with the youth too, that is telling God's story in a way that uh, they can hear it and internalize it and, and see themselves to be a, a part of it. Pick that apart a little bit about how you actually uh, communicate the, the story that comes out of the Bible uh, and, the, and the life of the church in a way that the kids can apprehend it and, and understand themselves to be a part of it. I think the, the first way that we do that is we are very careful as a, a staff, a group of people who are invested in the lives of these kids, to actually know what's going on in their lives. Right? We've invested ourselves in their communities. We show up at the art shows and the theater. I've probably seen more high school musicals than I, I can bear to talk about. Um, we do all of these things because it matters to them, but it also allows us a window into their lives. Now, once we have that, then we can sort of source out where we need to go. So for instance, if one of our kids uh, makes a really bad decision, right, or a series of really bad decisions, and there are consequences to be faced, one of the places we could often turn is to the creation story, that God's intention was that creation was good. Right? And at the same time, we can look at creation and we can remember the story of Adam and Eve and them being created out of the earth, right? this earthen image that was molded, and then grab Jeremiah the prophet and this example of the potter and the potter's wheel and how sometimes that shape is so beautiful and sometimes it falls apart, but it can be rebuilt. Right? All of these stories are part and parcel of our collective story, and they're there because the kids are living them. So it's a matter of bringing them to bear in a way that isn't, um, today we're going to talk about this, right? It, it's not nearly so pedantic as that. It's really about recognizing their story first and bringing to bear the beauty of Scripture and God's loving story with us um, kind of into that story.